doesn't matter. You still upset about last night. What would you expect? I still love you, stupid. All I said is I don't think we should get married yet. There's loads of time for that. So long. So what about this one? No, I want something more special. Well, we've got it in other colours. Yeah, I like that. Where'd you get that from? You just got it and stuck it back. Look, did I? Yeah, it'd really suit ya. Yeah, that's more like it. Why didn't I notice this before? Hi. Oh, you look like you're doing some cheering up. Morning. I've got a little surprise for you. Not now, Cindy. I've got these figures to do. <gasps> it's dead out there. Look, I've got a lot of work on. I've got business to run, you know. <sighs> you sound like Ian. Oh, I was a surprise. You'll find out when we get there. I'm sorry, not now. I can't spare the time. Honestly, and that's the truth. Are you sure? Listen, Gita, I've got a great idea. We hold a fashion show. A fashion show? Don't you think that's being a bit ambitious? Well, you said we needed something special. Yeah, that's true, but... Well, this is it. We let people see the clothes we're selling being worn, and they'll all want to buy them. We sell the clothes, make the money we need, good, not it? Well, it might be if we could get enough people to come. Well, I thought of that. We say it's a charity thing, giving the door money or something. Get Robbie to push around some leaflets. Where are we going to get the stock for all this? Well, I thought you might know about that. <laughs> Not for what we can afford, Bianca. Well, I'll find out then. What, just like that? Well, give me the afternoon off and I'll find out how to do it. Be like doing a bit of research, wouldn't it? Right, well, I suppose we can do without you for an afternoon. <sighs> Here we are. Yeah? No, yeah, just here. We're in the middle of nowhere. You'll see. Mr. Wicks? Mrs. Wicks, hello. hello. Now, if you'd like to follow me. Right. Come on, darling. Well, what do you think of it, Mr. Wicks? It's a repossession. You can move in whenever you like. But it wasn't quite what I was expecting. Oh, I'm sorry about my husband. Um, I think it's perfect. Would you mind leaving us on our own for a while? I'm sure I could talk him round. Well, I do have to get off to another appointment. I could leave the keys with you. Oh, would you mind? It might help him get a better feel for the place, you know. Just drop them back into the office. Thanks. What are you doing? She's giving us the chance to get a better feel. Should we start with the bedroom? You are on Glad you think so. I hope you're not bothered about splinters. Yeah. Cheer up, love. I'm only going away for a weekend. Right. What's up? It's Bianca. Oh. Well, tell me all about it then. Well, you know, I thought we got it together again, but now she don't want to get married. You proposed to her already? Yeah, what's wrong with that? Ricky, Rick, you never change, do you, love? It was you who messed things up in the first place. Now you got Bianca back, you want to pretend nothing's happened. It don't work like that. You've got to go slow. Well, I don't even know where she is half the time. Oh, not here to cook your dinner then? But this is serious, Pat. Now, when I want to get it together, she's off working. Or when we do go for a drink or something, she just goes on about her job. Well, this new job's important to her, Ricky. Anybody can see how much she loves it. You mustn't make her feel that you don't want her to make something of herself. So what do I do then? Give her space. She's got her space. She needs to know that you support her. Let her talk to you about things that are important to her, including her job. It will be fine, love, honest. I can be so sure. Because if I was Bianca, that's what I'd want. Cindy. Hi. Oh, hello. I found him. Our new manager. Now, oh. all we have to do is sit back and enjoy it while other people make us money. Great. See any houses? Yeah. Any good? Uh, yeah, but, uh, not for us. 